welcome back to another match day vlog. At a slightly later kickoff of 5.30 today, but with good reason. Arguably the biggest game of the League One weekend, Charlton Athletic versus Portsmouth. Both teams aren't exactly going through the greatest form right now. Charlton are unbeaten in their last four with one win and three draws, luckily sharing a point with Doncaster last weekend. I do feel Donny were cheated out of their last minute winner that was disallowed. Meanwhile, Pompey ended their five consecutive streak of drawing games against Bradford last weekend, smashing the living daylights out of them 5-1. However, it was their first win since New Year's Day and Charlton have only lost one game between that time frame, between New Year's Day and now. But the Addicts can't score. We have scored four goals in the last five games and they've been without Carl and Grant. That shows the impact of the transfer window. As I said, both teams are struggling, but Charlton are desperately struggling to score goals at the moment. Even Lyle Taylor is struggling to provide the goals, and he's now and he's got 12 goals to his name. He needs to bring his shooting boots today, and as does Igor Vitekele. Just everyone needs to bring their shooting boots and bring in product. Of course, if us not being able to score and Pompey having scored five goals in the last game, they'll be beaming with confidence, but Charlton are not a walkover, are we? But it's not going to be easy. Portsmouth are a very good team. They've got some very, very big threats in their side. Jamal Lowe, Ben Close is playing quite well at the moment. Ronan Curtis, Ben Thompson. James Vaughan's another player, but he's um, been on the bench. So I don't think he's had as much of an impact as Portsmouth would have liked him to. Omar Bogle is injured for Portsmouth, so that is good news for us. However, Jason Pearce for Cholton is going to be out for a lot longer than we thought, as his ankle injury is far worse than we once envisioned. Without any further hesitation, guys, let's get down to the valley and let's take some massively important three points away from Portsmouth. Come on, you Reds! First opening minutes, this game is living up to expectations. It's going to be a very insane, a very close game. Both teams have had equal amount of good chances. Electric atmosphere is looking good. Come on, Charlton. Literally just moments before that, Charlton came agonisingly close to make it 1-0. Rebo played in a brilliant ball into Williams. Williams put, it, Williams put it across the box. I think Bailey had a shot and I think Vetter Kayle got in the way and blocked it. That would have been a certain goal but Charlton have been playing phenomenally well. We've been all over them so far. Brilliant display for Charlton. Come on you Reds! Just past the half hour mark and Charlton seriously needs to grab a goal before half time. I feel we've been all over Pompey this first half. Pompey haven't really had that many decent clear cut chances. Charlton have been all over and we've missed so many opportunities. We need to find some input to grab a goal just before half time.
We've dominated them all game and then they go and do that. One all. Not being funny, but how easy was that? One all. Come on, Charlton. Second half just got underway. Charlton won, Portsmouth won. I've got to be honest. Charlton needs to boss Portsmouth this for the second half because we were all over in first half. Absolutely brilliant. So many chances. Couldn't put many of them away. Arrivo with a brilliant finish. And then they had, then they had one shot. And they scored from it from a corner, not good enough. But come on, Charlton. We need to boss these guys because we've absolutely killed them so far. Come on, Charlton. Lyle Taylor! Yes! in the final stages of the game. Despite Charlton absolutely tearing apart Portsmouth and absolutely bossing them all game, this is going to be a scary last few moments. Portsmouth still have that threat where they could, could nick a goal at any point. They're still, they aren't mugs, they still have quality. But Charlton have absolutely bossed them this whole game. But this will be a very, very dangerous and quite concerning last moments. A third goal is needed. Take nothing away from Charlton. They've been absolutely brilliant all game. Fantastic. Let's close the game off. And hang in there. Come on, Charlton.
Seriously, Charlton are asking for trouble. We're sitting back and not putting any pressure on them at all. We're asking for trouble. Four minutes early time, hang in there. We bossed them all game, hang in there. Oh my God.